I would just love to know what on God's green earth Ultra Games or Konami or whatever whatever name they were going under at the time was thinking when they made this piece of shit. This game is absolute garbage. It is terrible. Now, does that mean I hate this collection? The Calabunga collection? Not at all. Matter of fact, most of it's pretty darn good. But this game is just god awful. And then, of course, well, people, I freaking hate the way the way they did this game. I do. I think this game is terrible. And I think they really needed to redo this game, like, better than this. Because this game is a piece of shit. No, really, this game is garbage. Yeah. I mean, think about it. You basically made it so that, that way the Ninja Turtles have to go through their world. And, you know, get the pizzas they get. And get slices of pizza to regain their energy. Could you, like, I don't know, have made that a reward, like, you know, like, at the end of a level? I mean, I'm just saying. Yeah. What was Konami and, what was Konami or Ultra Games thinking at the time? And the answer is, I have no idea what they were thinking. I really don't know what they were thinking. Yeah, because... I don't know what in the world was going on at the, in their minds at the time. If any of you guys out there know, go ahead and let me know because I don't know. Yeah, I mean, think about it. You have to do. You have to do this. You have to find pizza slices or full pizzas just to regain your energy. <clears throat> Sorry, and they could have just made like you know. A pizza as a reward for like complete completing a level, and they couldn't just you know cut out the part with the with the you know the dam. They could have just made that level like skippable. It would have made so much more sense, you know. I'm just saying, guys. This this game drives me nuts. Yeah, because right here, what you're seeing right here, yeah. Let's just say this part was so simple. I don't know how Ultra Games or Konami or whatever name they were using at the time screwed this up. I really don't know how they screwed this up. Because this was not exactly what, this is not exactly what you'd call an easy game, no. This game is not only a challenge. It's a freaking miracle if you can actually if you can actually win. Yeah. If you can actually win at this game, well then good luck. Then I say good luck to you. And of course this is a trick that almost everybody knows at this point. About this about this piece of crap. Yeah, choose Donatello and get all those boxes. And he ducks down lower than he already he gets hurt when he ducks down lower than he already is. I mean, like, did that defy, like, some law of physics or something? Or am, I just, or am I completely nuts? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what in the world happened there. Yeah, see? When I'm up here, he can't hurt me. Yeah, and of course. Of course, of course, of course. How very silly of me. How silly of me not to remember... That Konami or Ultra Games or whatever name they were going under at the time. Yeah, I mean, this is ridiculous, you guys. This is freaking ridiculous. I really do not know, and I really cannot for the life of me, understand what Konami or Ultra Games was thinking at the time when they made this. I mean, how did they go about acquiring the license to make the make this game anyway, and make the and make Ninja Turtles Two the arcade game, which yeah, it's kind of a butchered port of the arcade game, yes, but it but at least 
but at least it's act, it actually feels you know like a Ninja Turtles game. Whereas I'm going to think this isn't one. I really don't think this is a Ninja Turtles game at all. Yes, it has the Ninja Turtles in it, but it doesn't feel like one. Yeah. <laughs> No, really, I, I don't believe this actually is a Ninja Trolls game, unless it started out as, like, I don't know, something else. Just saying. So, I begin to wonder, seriously, what were they thinking back then when they made this? And if I remember right, this came out, like, a few months after the arcade game, if I recall correctly. I could be wrong. I don't know. I don't know. I think that I think that's the rumor I heard back then. Was it this came out like a few months after the arcade game, which by the way is freaking awesome? Yeah. I mean, could they not have oh I don't know. Could they not have like I don't know. Maybe done something with this? You know, like... You know, maybe, maybe, like... I don't know. Like, basically say, Yeah, this is not a Ninja Turtles game. Yet, here it is. I mean... Really, Kenobi? Or Ultra Games? Or, who, or whoever made this? Really? You really couldn't have made this any better. You could have done better with this. Seriously, you couldn't have? Really? Because honestly, what I think you could have. Oh yes, I do. I mean, if this is really the best you could do... Because guys, this game really does piss me off. No, this game really does piss me off. Now, do I think all the games in the Cow Monday collection piss me off? No, not all of them. This one does, though. Yeah, I just want to throw it. I just want to get this little, you know, video out there for you guys. If you guys, you know, do enjoy this, and I hope you do. You know, let me know if you guys want to do, want me to do this for other games in the Calbunga, Calbunga collection. And I'll see what I can do about making that happen for you. Yeah. And now we're getting to the part that really, really pisses me off. Ugh, God, this, God, this part. This part is such a pain in the neck. Look at this. Yeah. Give you a little over two minutes to complete this level. And and you have to disarm bomb eight bombs. Um who put those bombs there in the first place? Shredder? Or was it was it some of the foot soldiers? I don't know. They never freaking tell you who did this. God, this game eats. This game really does eat, like, terribly. This game literally is terrible. No, it is. This game is god-awful. So, in my opinion, is this game worth playing? No. Does this game suck? Oh, undeniably. And this level right here is why. They should have just left this level out of the game altogether. Oh yes, they should have. They should have left this out, my friends. And it would have been, it would have been much better. Oh yeah. <sighs> now do you guys see why I can't stand this level? Why I can't stand this game? Now do you guys get my point? What the fuck? What, what was Konami or Ultra Games thinking at the time when they made this? I mean, were those guys like out of their minds when they made this? 
organization, oh yeah, we got that Ninja Turtles license and we can do whatever we want with it. So why don't we just make a game that really, that, tr that truly sucks ass. And yes, this game truly does suck ass. Oh, and by the way, guys, if you guys are liking this video, go and leave a like on the video. Share your thoughts in the comments down below. <sighs> Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And share the video around for those who want to see. Click that bell to be notified for future videos. And do not forget to subscribe for more of me and these videos you shall see. Dear God, Konami, Alter Caves, what were you thinking when you made this? I don't know what you were thinking. I don't know. Till next time, my friend.